Hello, my name is Bill and welcome to Mind Your Crypto. Today we have Bitcoin Daily update. We are going to see, guys, where are we going? Where is the risk? How far can we go? And what you should do. Before we begin, join the monthly subscription to get easy profits with automated signal buying and selling opportunities. This is amazing. This is something revolutionary. You will know exactly when to buy and exactly when to sell. Join in and of course you will get personal guidance and many educational videos. Only 50 people can join in and the link is in the description down below. Buy me a coffee slash mind your crypto. You can also join our telegram group chat. We help each other every day. Hit the like button, subscribe because it helps so much with the daily updates. If you can't understand how much this helps and thank you all for the support guys until now okay thank you thank you thank you let's go now to the resistance levels and you can see that we have the 44,000 tether usd if you draw guys the fibonacci retracement from the top right here on 9th may to the bottom we form back on 22nd june then you will notice that we have the 44,000 tether usd in which we are right now okay we have one major resistance level the 0.618 is at the 47,500. Okay. So what is going to happen? What are we going to do right now? Okay, because we are going upwards. We had a minor correction right here and now we went upwards again. Let's see a little bit. You can see that on the four hour frame right now we had an overbought situation. We have the cut that it is a bit skeptical right here. You can see that with the, the eyes and the ears. It is a bit skeptical on where we should, what we should do and what we should be doing right now. Okay, so in my opinion guys we are in an overbought situation actually we were now we are not in the four hour frame on the rsi the common channel index is in a way overbought situation right here same with the stochastic rsi so two out of three risk metrics are in an overbought situation but i won't stay on the four hour frame for so long because on the four hour frame we can't get the uh, the things needed to say if we are approaching a top I will just go on the daily frame and on the daily frame there is something that it is uh, a little bit uh what it worries me a little bit you can see that on the rsi the we have an rsi bearish divergence when we are having a lower high in the rsi i don't think that we can go even even higher than the previous one i believe that we have a potential rsi bearish divergence lower highs in the rsi and higher highs in the price so you have to be careful you have to book some profits right there because you don't know what we should be doing in the next few days okay because either way guys even if we go and go to the 0 0.618 47 000 tether usd then i believe we will see a big big crash afterwards okay so we, you have to be a little bit careful because we are getting on the daily frame the Paris RSI divergence. Uh, if we just surpass, guys, the 44,000, then you know that the next stop will be at 47,700, okay? And in case we correct, let's say that we are here, okay? And we correct a little bit. Let's say that we will correct. Then I will draw the Fibonacci starting from the bottom to the top. And you can see some major support levels that we have right Right now and you can see that we have the first one is around 40,500 the next one is around 38,400 to 300 around there 38,000 actually to 38,400 and of course we have the 36,600 for now for the short term uh the other uh, support levels guys are more for the midterm uh till we get there we it might take us a while till we get back to 34,800 for now we have to look at these support levels and you you can see that even the minus 0 0.236 is near the 47,700. You can see that we have the minus 0 0.236 Fibonacci retracement near the, the previous high we had before. Okay, so yes, the next resistance level is this one. If I retraw the Fibonacci retracement, you will see that we had the, uh, the 0 0.618 close to the minus 0 0.236 Fibonacci retracement. Okay, so yeah, we have the 
this area of resistance level in case we go upwards this is the next price target guys for bitcoin but you should be careful because i told you uh what i am scared of i am scared of an rsi bearish divergence and right there if we have that it won't be so good for bitcoin we might be dropping down uh we have to be a little bit careful the same happens with the commodity channel index as you can see on the daily frame on the weekly frame guys let's go a little bit on the weekly frame we had an extremely oversold situation for quite some time right there for the stochastic RSI, for the commodity channel index as well and of course we had guys the double bottom almost the double bottom and you can see that we had the commodity channel index flirting with the minus 100 so yes on the weekly frame we are very very uh we can grow a little bit more guys on the macro perspective we can grow but of course we should be very very careful right there okay we should be very very careful but because on the daily frame it looks like we are about to make an rsi bearish divergence it is not sure yet because we might not stop here we might not stop here and go a little bit upwards if we go even higher guys then this will mean that we don't have a bearish rsi divergence and the 47700 is very very likely to happen the 47700 tether usd is very likely to happen and of course guys you can see that if we get if we don't get a bearish rsi divergence then i truly believe we can grow a little bit more for the bitcoin you can and see that we can go to 47,700 and the next price targets are the 51,000, 53,000 but these are guys very very hard it is very very hard to get there it is very very hard to get there for me let's see though what will happen i always want to minimize the risk and i always want to be honest with you guys i don't want to be the classical moon boy that will tell you yes we are going all the way upwards no not yet we have to confirm and surpass many many resistance levels in order to say that we will be going to the previous all-time highs for now just think that we might get a bearish rsi divergence and the next price target is the 47 thousand uh, and 700 around there which is actually also the 0 0.618 golden ratio always remember that and be careful guys for now because i would love to say that you should book some profits right there not a financial advice but personally i would book some profits i have booked already some profits guys and you should do that in my opinion too okay so this was the video for now thank you so much for watching do not forget to join our monthly subscription to get easy profits with automated selling and buying opportunity signals and of course just Join our telegram group chat hit the like button subscribe if you like the content thank you thank you see you soon with many many more videos bye